No. Hi, you guys. Uh, it's me and Brianna. We're in the publishing lab, and I'm eating pretzels, and we have to go because we have a writer's club meeting, so this has to be super duper fast. But um, we're supposed to be talking about what's the subject? What's um, the subject? LGBT okay, idols, one I guess. Of our idols, like yeah. That and is fluent in the LGBT. I made it sound like a language. That was my bad. <laughs> Um, anyway, so one of my biggest idols is, um, Ani DeFranco, and she doesn't really, she's a singer-songwriter, and she's, like, just, ah, and it's an amazing artist and, like, poet, and, um, her, her, her work makes me kind of want to weep and laugh sometimes, and it's just, like, so powerful, and she's, um, she's rather political, but she's not so much a gay rights activist as, like, um, a feminist, and... I, I don't know, like, very liberal, and, but, yeah, she's awesome, and she plays, like, everything from, like, she'll have, like, horns in one song, and then it'll just be her and her guitar, in another song she'll have pianos, and, like, just, like, basically, like, she, it's kind of weird, just gonna be honest, like, if you, if you look her up, um, her music is kind of, it's kind of weird, but you get used to it, and then you start to love it, and then you embrace the weirdness, and that is all, it is for you, turn. <laughs> Hi, Rainbow Gang viewers. I decided to film my half at home because Writers Club was, you know, it was stuff. We had to, yeah, stuff to do. And, um, I decided that it would give me a little bit more time to, you know, figure out who I wanted to talk about. And, um, there are so many LGBT people that I respect highly. And, I mean, you know, um... Elton John, Ru RuPaul, artists like that, um, David Levithan, but I decided that I was going to talk about one person in particular, and that's Freddie Mercury, because Freddie Mercury was a great musician, and, you know, he was one of, like, the first out musicians, I think, you know? Like, one of the really popular out rock musicians. And I think that was pretty ballsy of him. So, that's why I chose to do him for this. And, yeah. I I had a thing going into this, and now I just, I don't. It's <laughs> sad. But, um, Freddie Mercury, I mean, I know I mentioned him when we talked about um, LGBT musicians. Um... I just highly respect him, and I think he was one of the greatest artists of all time. And, you know, if you don't know who he is, you know, the singer from Queen, I mean... I don't know why you're watching the Rainbow Gang. <laughs> JK, not really. Um, it's like 10.30, guys, I'm sorry. Um... I also find it very tragic that he had, um, died too suddenly, I think, and it was because of AIDS-related causes, you know, and I, I, I've read a lot of things online like, oh, he deserved it, that's what he gets for being a fag, and I'm just like, ugh. He was one of the greatest musicians ever, he was groundbreaking, you know? I mean, how could you say that about someone as wonderful a musician is that. I mean, that's just awful. Um, thank you for watching my train wreck half of this, guys. Stay gay. We love you. Goodbye.